As we're talking about these productions, we have a lot of things that are very basic. We have a lot of Zoom meetings, Teams meetings. This has been the last year plus of our lives as we're doing this content. And we really wanna make this more engaging. And so we have this new software in TC2 called Live Call Connect, and it's really easy to use. It'll take the giving meeting room, let's say Zoom or Teams or what have you, and convert up to nine callers into individual signals into our switcher. So now, instead of having to worry about some of the issues that we traditionally encounter when we're doing like a screen scrape or something like that, what we instead get in our production pipeline is a bunch of individuals that we can now work with as individual sources. That allows us to change the presentations we're making. And I think if we combine this concept with what we just talked about in NDI 5, you'll start to see that when you're working in an NDI ecosystem, working with a TriCaster is the best bet you can have. The Live Call Connect feature set is exclusive to the TC2, which is a 32 input 4K switcher. So the amount of NDI switches that you can push into this device is very large. Today, Live Call Connect works with a couple of uh, uh, virtual meeting platforms. Uh, we can work with uh, Teams, we can work with Zoom, Discord, Tencent, um, and, and, and that list is sort of not fixed. And the whole idea here is we made this easy. Nine callers, a mix minus can talk back to that channel. So you don't have to do any sophisticated audio controls when you're working with Live Call Connect. But where this really, really ties together and, and sort of where I wanna end up is here. When we're working with a TriCaster, we now have the ability to work with local sources, audio, web feeds, SRT, remote sources, remote guests. The, the variety of ways that we can grab content is so large with some of the things we talked about in NDI 5, things like Live Call Connect, there are a lot of ways to get somebody from anywhere, whether it be on their cell phone, on their laptop or otherwise, into your TriCaster's production pipeline. And then at that point, now you're leveraging the most, you know, this is the switcher that is built upon NDI because we at New Tech sort of created NDI and with Viz Group, you know, this is our baby. Uh, uh, but now we have the ability to stream this content, do remote delivery of this content, distribute in our AV location. We can have comms and post-production pipelines. It really all comes together and ties together neatly when you're working with a TriCaster. And so I think if you are sort of been dabbling in NDI or using an NDI product already, uh, whether it be a switcher or a converter or what have you software, I think it is a good time to be looking at what new tech is doing on the product side and potentially integrate that into your entire production. And last but not least, because we are doing all of this stuff with remote enablements, the TriCaster series all have a KVM feature. So it can be any event anywhere and you can interface with your TriCaster, you can bring in your remote guests, you don't even have to be on site with your system to leverage these, these, this sort of immense uh, workflow. 